all right guys welcome to gospel reactions once again thank you so much for always liking for sharing subscribing telling everyone about what we do right here at gospel yeah. tv yes today i've got the one the only lala daddy in the building yo 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 pro 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 and the time we sing with you, the song way the time we make. Po po po. I'm gonna see you be. Part one. I don't hear. I don't hear. <laughs> okay, Lala, you're welcome to the show. Mm -hmm. Um, what's your name? Lala. 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 The Machala Not Obio. himself. Well, Obio, yes, yes, but okay, Whiskey, but whiskey is yes, certain. Whiskey the Machala himself. Now, Whiskey has been out of Nigeria for a while now. Yeah, a lot of you know people, you know, London today, mm -hmm. New York today, and London tomorrow. Yeah, Whiskey has been going, you know, touring the world, yeah. trying to record for the album and everything. And of course, some weeks back, it was seen in the studio with Bonner Boy. They recorded the song Ginger. That. Off made in Lagos, yeah, yeah, and another you know week again, him, Skepta, and Bonner yeah. were in the studio again recording a couple of songs. Mm -hmm. Now that has gotten fans really, really excited about the whole thing. Mm -hmm. Fans are asking, so, Whiskey and Bonner Boy, are we expecting a joint collaboration, like a collaborative album, you know, or an EP, or is it? In a plethora of singles, or mm -hmm. what exactly should fans expect? Well, uh, I think what I should expect, like mm. we've seen them in the two separate videos, mm. we don't know if it's from the same day or maybe mm -hmm. from different days. But the fact that they were in originally in the studio together for a particular song, and then there was another video with them with Skepta, mm -hmm. that got people talking and thinking, oh, maybe there's a there's an EP in the works. But I don't think mm -hmm. it's going to be a joint album, but I think, yes, if it's an EP, mm -hmm. it should be very dope. You know mm -hmm. why? Mm -hmm. Because it, it's always rare to see very, very top acts in Nigeria combined for a joint album. Yeah. <coughs> very, very top acts. <laughs> Come on now. Shade. Very, very top acts. Alamde and Fino doing, we understand the significance of it, even for, for the hip-hop scene. Yeah, for the hip-hop scene, yeah. You get that. I'm saying the very, very, this, these guys are the, the top. Echelon. Top echelon top like that top so it's very weird like usually there's like we always say there's rivalry in these things and it's mm -hmm. better for usually they don't try and combine mm -hmm. uh talent or fan base for anything as we all know if you don't try to do something like that we will risk it didn't materialize yeah. but if it is indeed what is in in the works mm -hmm. with Bonner boy and uh whiskey what should we expect straight up fire man straight up fire man it's going to be a, a statement like mm -hmm. like if we comes to fruition like mm -hmm. it will be a state a big statement and it will just mean that yes it is possible to collaborate and still be the biggest i mean co collaborate with your with your peers, your peers on the project yeah. and <coughs> still be the biggest whether you're the biggest or you're not the or you're the first or you're the second, it's possible it will be a statement not only to the to the top edge even to the the ones in in, in the bit that are in the mid section yeah. they say the b list people yeah. are, and things like that it will also be a a, a, a a point for the top ladies in the game that yes you can actually collaborate, collaborate together. with each other if that's what they're they're working on so if you're going if they're going to come out with a project together mm -hmm. man everybody's going to be hyped up for it so who are the guys that you think um apart from whiskey mm -hmm. and bonaboy i mean a collaborative project yeah. either an ep or an album or something yeah most likely an ep you get who are the guys you think should be on that you know um, um ep or you know the project this is this is just wild thinking, right? Yeah. So on that EP, we already know okay, fine, they let's say they had a Skepta, that's one mm. from the UK in the in the in the EP. Which kid bring in Skepta? Skepta. Bonner boy brings Stormzy. Stormzy. <laughs> Bonner boy brings Stormzy. And maybe Steph London. And uh, Steph London and uh, another song. <coughs> and then they need to look inwards, if possible. In if Nigeria. Pos if yes. possible, extend the same hands to our brother Davido. <gasps> Ah, that's, that's never ever going to happen. Why do you think so? That's no, never going to yeah, happen. I, feel I think this is a perfect opportunity. Bro, like if Bonner to, and Whiskey to, collaborative project and they, they bring on Davido, why can't it happen? 
like are you joking here like no, no, like, 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 like i like, said before i said for real? before i mentioned i said this is wild thinking like there's nothing that will stop it from happening it might be a way to always put an uh, to put an end there's no point three of them coming together and say they want to do a joint three three man yeah EP. three man ep it's not going to make sense yeah but if it's two people doing an ep i think davido if the opportunity does arrive for davido he should just be the bigger person and leave away whatever is hurting him the fact that he tried to do a whiskey that it didn't work just be the bigger hmm. person and i'm here and this I'm here if about, the opportunity comes to davido should jump on a pro on a on bona whiskey's collaborative if, project if, if, if that they, happens yes if they ask him i would urge him to do it because it puts an end to all the back and forth whether they try to do a song together or not and things like that it will be it will be awkward yeah i hmm. get it but if the opportunity arises you should grab it with two hands it's an opportunity he said he doesn't want fighting mm -hmm. it's an opportunity to end everything what was this ep you know if it i mean like you said while thinking yeah we've seen bonner and Wiz in the studio so many times right now yeah. so fans have been saying there's something coming up there's a project now what would a um what does a whiskey and bonner boy collaborative project what does it mean for you know uh, the nigerian music industry as a whole like i said before like it means a lot like it means a lot like We've not had now. Let's go far back. No one has really, apart from Fino and Lambda, like you said. Mm -hmm. Do as at the time they even did those collaborations. They were like the top, almost the top. No one said they were the top because there, there was the MI and some yeah. other yeah. guys there. Yeah. But they were like top of the top tier when it comes to rap in Nigeria, and mm -hmm. they came together, combined efforts for that joint EP. Mm -hmm. So that was dope, and that was dope for hip hop mm -hmm. in Nigeria. So if the guys at the pop scene now decide to do this. It will be very dope for the get collaboration is very important, especially for the younger ones. But mm -hmm. if people who are looking up to them can see those kind of things, they will be able open to even equally collaborate. Not collaborate. collaboration that they will pay you to come and collaborate. Like equally vibe and collaborate with yourselves to vibe. There's a lot of B list artists who haven't even featured each other. Yes. But yes. they they would rather get collaborations from people who are willing to pay them. Mm. I mean, if you talk about the female, the females, for example, now, a lot of silent beefs I don't know about. A lot of Billy's <laughs> female artists, true. you will not see them on the same song together. True. true. If 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 they are, if they get to know that oh this one uh, this one wants to collaborate or this one is, is sing is on is appearing on this song and you want it to do it, they will blatantly refuse. That's mm. how it works. On a whiskey and Bonaboy collaborative project, yeah. who do you think fans would expect more from? More. Yes. I think. You know, you know the way fans are now. They want to always say this one killed this one or this mm -hmm. one. They want to. That's the thing. So I, I, I don't think they will expect more from anybody. But I think the the core fans of each individual artist mm -hmm. would blow the trumpet of their guys <laughs> so much. So that I don't know. It, it may cost. I don't know. If that's if they pay too much attention to what the fans are saying. Mm. I don't think they, they will expect them to do much. But it will just. It's the fans that will do the. The shouting. The shouting. Yeah, they do most of the shouting. So I don't think they will expect the more from any of these artists. But okay, the for for this particular EP yeah. uh, that we've imagined, looking back at you know the studio sessions that Bonner and Wiz yeah. have, have had, if this EP between Bonner and Wizkid comes to pass, yeah. if it does come to pass, and Davido is not on it, I won't be surprised. Lamy Day is not on it. I mean, you won't be surprised. I won't be surprised. <coughs> I'm just saying what, it would make sense if they are. What? How do you think? Davido would feel already. There's an interview, you know, which you said he said, "Oh, there's a gang up, there's a gang up against him and everything." Yeah. Now, having an EP, Whiskey and Bonner Boy, mm -hmm. and Davido is not part of the plan. What happens to Davido? I think it it will only just well, like he already has at the back of his mind that people in the industry are against him. Like he mentioned in the interview, uh, it looks like a gang up. He also mentioned. People, the whole industry featured on Beyonce's album, and he wasn't told. He wasn't, wasn't told. Yeah, it's only fuel that sort of thinking from him, right? But like I said before, it doesn't necessarily have to think like that. Like it looks like he's being left out, mm -hmm. and uh, those are the things that that push him the more. So if he's if he doesn't make, well, we don't even know if they're going to give him the opportunity or <laughs> <laughs> or even ask him to mm -hmm. be on it. But if they give him the opportunity, I'll tell him to please take the opportunity and be on it. But what happens to him? It will only just put him in another. St it, it, the state of mind won't be nice for him mm. because it feels like he's been left out again, mm. and that people are actually hating on him. That's what's going to happen to him. I don't see. I don't think he's going to come out of it as, oh, no yawa. But you can say no yawa to the public, but inside of inside in the heart he's, of his heart, you know that he's, 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 he's going to be painful. Yeah. Celebrities are 
you know, people that you know, I look you know, up to yeah. as regards to using their platform yeah. to create societal changes in the mm-hmm, society. Mm-hmm. Uh, we know, you know, Vincent Whiskey was saying, blasting some government officials, including Even the, the president. president. You get David o has been tweeting the answers and all of those things. Yeah. You know, Bonaboy has said, no, I'm not, I'm not a bay. When anytime it's time to do the real talking mm. of gas boost, you can call me. But when it comes to tweeting and going to the street, I'm not all for that. That's what I'm going to What's the view of Bass Boost if he's not tweeting and going to Basic, the street? I, I, like, I, I, I want to know. Maybe we should ask Bonaboy. Boy. Now, celebrities are people who, you know, uh, the fans look up to. Yeah. Now, if Bonaboy Boy and Whiskey eventually come up with this collaborative project, yeah. what kind of direction sh- do you think they should take looking at the platforms that they, that they have? What kind of direction? In terms of the music? Yeah, in terms of the music, what direction do you think they should take? Yeah, they're going to go up seeing the type of songs Bonaboy Boy makes, mm. Afrobeats kind of like conscious sometimes, mm-hmm. and a bit of love, pop. Should they, go con- should they go all conscious? No, I don't think they're going to go conscious. Uh, they, they're not those, they're not that type of artist. I don't think they're going to come together because don't forget that these guys have a fan base to cater for not only in Nigeria and outside of the country. And if you're going to bring the two of them to do a, a collaborative project, they, they can't if they're going to do a, a conscious song, I don't, I doubt it to be, be more than one song on the EP mm. or any project. That's what it's going to be. The rest will just be dedicated to the sort of songs that they make, Afro pop, Afro beats, and things mm-hmm. like that. That's what I'll be expecting. <laughs> um, fans, as well. I mean, we can't leave out the fans, you know, in this conversation yeah. of you know talking about how um, Bonner Boy has not really, really been okay. that. African giant, <laughs> you understand? Yeah. Well, Whiskey, you know, has been, uh, you know, abused by a couple of fans. Say, oh, you are disrespectful to the president. Yeah. You should have respect because you have money and everything. Do you think it's his fans? Those are paid people from the government. <laughs> the first person that said that thing is the special assistant to the president. Oh, for real? The, what's her name? Loretta. Loretta, Loretta. yeah. Loretta she's she's an employee yeah. of the yeah, government. Of the so government. if she says that and the other people who are for uh, the government, people will, will follow suit and say that. I'm even shocked that uh, newspapers were carrying. I mean, people were saying, uh, writing articles about the uh, uh, fans come for mm-hmm. whiskey. Like, it wasn't even the case. If anything, majority of the people True. in Nigeria agree with what whiskey is doing. Mm-hmm. So yeah. Now, whiskey is a known artist out there to the world. Bonaboy yeah. Boy is a known artist as well. Yeah. If there's one Nigerian artist, talented yeah. young artist, that mm-hmm. you think Wiz and Bonner should help with this project, yeah. who would it be? Uh, from the from the Bonner camp, I think Buju number one. Mm-hmm. Has to be present from the whiskey camp. We know Terry is his boy. Has to be present. Leave Buju and leaving Buju and Terry. Okay. Who is that one guy or girl or lady must, or a guy? Must the person be be already here. Now you think has support. mad potential and just needs an international platform of a Bonner whiskey. Like, like you think this project is going to blow? I mean, you look at the Bonner and whiskey project. Like, yeah. ah, this project will blow up this guy if you put him on. <laughs> If they want to cause Wala, it's just going to carry me your coon. That's not to cause Wala, or just put me your coon on that project. But then again, we know me your coon's contract, Davido mm-hmm. has expired, and mm-hmm. Davido won't, won't actually stop him, but it will mm-hmm. be, it will be pl- them this playing dirty. Out-y. No, it won't be disloyalty. Uh, Davido won't mind. Yeah. But then it, it will, it, people will read another made into it, like they just disrespecting mm. Davido. That's mm. what it looks like. But on to your question, uh, Fireboy DML. That's possible. Fireboy, Fireboy, not Belash Mother? No, Belash Mother is not ready for the international scene. No, Abba. Is, no, no. Is it, to, well, well. It's not ready for it could, that. It could, it could push him to that, um, really? to that point. You think Fireboy DML, okay, but if Fireboy DML and Wiz Kid, you know, mm-hmm. collaborate with, you know, will bang really, really well. Yes, he will. And of course, Wiz is close to uh, Olamide. Yeah. He's a Fireboy's um, mm-hmm, uh, mm-hmm. boss. And there's also Omale. Oh, Omale. Eh, Omale. Yeah. Also Joe Boy. Umale, this is your boy. Yeah, so but I'll go with Fireboy. You know, see, see when you see this face on uh, Gusto, uh, this you are saying Fireboy Stan. Stan. <laughs> when you see this face. Fireboy DML, yes. Finally, before we go, yeah. um, looking at we talked about um Bonaboy, Afro Fusion, yeah. Afrobeat, whiskey with the Afrobeat, you know, vibe as well, yeah. with R and B, a couple of other things. Now, who are the producers that you would expect on this particular project? I mean, already I know for sure P two G. We'll be there sure, constant K. I think we're going to have guys from the Starboy team as well. We might have Mute, Mute of Legendary Beats. Mm-hmm. We can have uh, Black Tells, Tells from 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 Bonas Camp. From Bonas Camp, 
If you're going to look at someone neutral, yeah, probably neutral. a SARS. Look at SARS. SARS is tough, boy. Uh, not is not necessarily. I don't think he is. I don't think he's yeah, But he, he has this affiliation. Someone who doesn't, who doesn't have an affiliation with them. Mm-hmm. Uh, who's, who's popping right now? Mm, nah, I don't you don't think, think Fuse I don't would think they do, do well on a wizard? Nah, I'm not saying, I'm not saying he travel. won't do well, but I don't think he would be the one to produce it. I don't think he will. For real? Why? If you have a fire boy, you don't think the song of fire boy I have Fuse Yes. Though, isn't it? yes. No, not necessarily because the source of the song is not from YBN, so it, it, it might not be. <laughs> Who else is there? Who else is there? Hmm. Um, it's hard to think. I think they'll just get people from the from the <laughs> from that. One is just spotlight a producer that yeah, one what, producer. Let's say a Krakamalo. Or oh, Kraka 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 Krakamalo. Yeah, Krakamalo, really, really dope guy. I mean yeah. everything. Lala on a scale of ten. Yeah. One to ten. If Bonner and Whiskey eventually come up with this collaborative EP, yeah. what would you be expecting on a scale of one to ten? Quality of music. Quality of music, delivery, everything. I'll be explaining something in the mode of seven and seven point five over ten. Whoa. Just because they're it's too low. No, I don't think it's too it's low. Bonner and Whis? Yeah. It, it, no, they need to work extra like hard. To actually even impress people because when big names collaborate is it, like there's extra scrutiny on how well the songs are and everything mm. so they need to work extra hard to so i don't want to make people expect too much but seven if they do a seven or, or seven point five over ten ep then that'll be that'll be good enough all right i i, I mean i totally agree with you of course mm. guys thank you so much for watching it's been custom reactions whiskey the matala himself and of course, the man that is twice as tall, yeah. the African giant. That is what we know. A lot of people say he's not a giant. But of course, African giant, Bonner Boy, yes, they've been in the studio all along and everything. Fans have been asking, is there a collaborative project? Mm -hmm. Yes, some very, very, you know, some sources are saying, oh, they have a project together. What do you think about that project if it eventually sees the light of the day? Is it going to be a hit? Or it's going to be a miss that already thinks oh, 7.5 that's a hit already yeah that's a hit already yes <laughs> let us know what you expect from that particular project when if not when no if it's it eventually, eventually comes, comes out. out yes <laughs> what do you expect guys let us know thank you so much it's been gusto reactions we'll see you on the next one stay safe keep liking keep subscribing i will see you cheers